want to share with you guys why mentorship is so valuable when it comes to starting a business on your own. What I always tell people is that mentors are your new teachers. Because if you think about it, when we were born, we've always had someone there who was smarter than us that we trusted to show us the path to success in whatever it was that we were trying to do. Think about it. When we were babies, we learned how to walk and talk from our parents. We also learned social norms from our parents as well. Then when we got to school, we learned how to read and write from teachers and teachers and parents and coaches have been guiding us and teaching us how to grow up all the way up until we're 18 years old. And for some people, it goes all the way up until they're 22 years old when they graduate from college. Why is it that as soon as we leave structured school, the learning from mentors and the seeking out of knowledge from mentors all of a sudden stops? You think about it, there's so many people out there that look at these online gurus as scams. They look at them as, you know, like just scammy people, untrustworthy, but they stop learning. Instead of looking at, at as mentors, as teachers that can help and guide and show people the path to success, they look at them as like a con artist or a scan and they stop learning. And at that moment, when you stop learning from other people, that's when growth actually becomes restricted. And I'll share with you guys how this actually played out in my life because it did. All the way from, you know, zero to 18, I've had teachers, but I've always rebelled against the teachers. I've always kind of had a chip on my shoulder. I was always getting in trouble. I was never really a favorite by any of my teachers or any of my coaches. I was never really like a teacher's pet by any means. And I also had a little bit of, of resentment towards authority in general. So when I was 18 years old, I decided, hey, I'm not going to go to school. You know, I don't really want to conform into this stuff. I'm going to figure it out on my own. What I'll tell you guys is that I struggled for so long because I was trying to do it on my own. I didn't know what I didn't know. And I was trying things that I thought were, were a good idea. Whereas if I just had someone who guided me and showed me the way, I would have saved myself plenty of time and plenty of heartbreak, plenty of headache and gotten to my goals a lot faster. Some of the things that I tried was to try to start a clothing business, but I had no idea about anything logistical or anything. You know, I just had no idea what I was doing. I started a coaching business and again, no clue what I was doing, didn't have any systems in place, didn't even know how to get clients. It was just failure after failure after failure after failure. I, I really wanted to be an entrepreneur, but like I just wasn't getting anywhere. It wasn't until I was 23 years old, literally five years later that I finally broke down and was like, look, I need to get help. You know, there's a guy online that I've been watching. I've liked his stuff. I like what he has to teach. I would love to learn from him. I made that investment and he literally showed me what I needed to do to be successful. And I realized that mentorship has been the key in the missing secret I was missing all along. Literally from that moment, I've been able to grow my business over and over again every single month by investing in new mentors. And now at this point, I'm from you know 23 to 26, I've invested well over multiple six figures in coaching and mentors because I understand that the only way we grow as humans is to learn from other humans that have been down the path a little bit longer than us, that are a little bit smarter than us. They are our teachers. That five-year stint where I didn't have any teachers or any any mentorship is now lost in the abyss forever. I'll never get that time back, but I can make up that time by investing in new teachers and new new mentorship. That's kind of the way I see mentorship is that your mentors are your teachers. Why would you stop investing in learning, especially for a certain topic when we've had teachers our entire life. So instead of thinking of your mentor as a scam or pe these people, uh, these online gurus as a scam, think of them as teachers that are going to be able to help and guide you to your goals.